Welcome to the Pure BMC Supra Physiologic Processing Video for the 60 milliliter Concentrating System. In this video, we will process 60 milliliters of bone marrow concentrate. First, we will begin with priming the bone marrow needle and filter. Use heparin solution 1000 units per milliliter as the anticoagulant of choice. You may also use citrate anticoagulant if heparin is not available. To begin, aspirate 15 milliliters of heparin into the 60 milliliter syringe. Remove the stylet from the bone marrow needle and prime the needle. Then reinsert the stylet. Connect the heparin syringe to the out port of the BMA filter and prime the filter by injecting and removing the anticoagulant. Transfer the heparin to five 12 milliliter syringes. Put one milliliter of heparin in each syringe. Using standard technique, Aspirate 11 milliliters of bone marrow aspirate into each 12 milliliter heparinized syringe, filling five syringes to 12 milliliters. Connect each 12 milliliter bone marrow syringe to the import of the bone marrow filter. Then connect a 60 milliliter syringe to the out port of the filter. Filter by injecting the bone marrow from each 12 milliliter syringe through the filter into the 60 milliliter syringe. Make sure the vent lid is in the open position. Swab the ports with sterile alcohol before and after accessing with a sterile syringe or cap. As a mandatory step, always attach the clear non-vented cap to the bottom port prior to centrifugation. Attach the 60 milliliter bone marrow syringe to the top port of the device. Slowly inject bone marrow into the device. When completed, close the vent. Use the counterbalance device to counterbalance with equal volume. Be sure to always place the clear non-vented cap to the bottom port of the counterbalance device as well. Place both devices in the centrifuge rotor at opposite ends. Follow the protocol settings provided in the IFU insert. Close the centrifuge lid and press start. After centrifugation, attach the sterile syringe accessory to the needleless port and aspirate the bone marrow plasma suspension. Then open the stopcock to the 3 milliliter syringe and aspirate 2 milliliters of red blood cells. Transfer the aspirated solution into the concentrator device as shown. Inject the bone marrow red blood cells first, then the bone marrow plasma suspension.
As a mandatory step, always attach the clear non-vented cap to the bottom port prior to centrifugation. Place back into the centrifuge rotor at opposite ends. Follow the protocol settings provided in the IFU insert. Close the centrifuge lid and press start. After centrifugation, the bone marrow buffy coat layer will be clearly visible at the bottom of the device. Remove the clear non-vented cap from the bottom port and attach a sterile syringe. Aspirate plasma, leaving seven milliliters of solution in the device. Resuspend the cell concentrate back into the plasma by rocking and swirling the device back and forth. Do this until all of the concentrate have been resuspended into the plasma and is no longer visible at the bottom of the device. Attach the 12 milliliter syringe to the needleless port and tilt the device to aspirate the bone marrow concentrate. This concludes our processing video.